What's up everybody? Welcome to Moro Bay. What are we gonna be doing today, baby? We're gonna be eating all the good foods. We're gonna be walking around, showing you some of the shopping, so make sure you stay tuned so that way you can learn all the secrets that Moro Bay has for you. this over here Dominic it's a giant chessboard look at that that's so cool I mean it's full of bird poop <laughs> but it's still pretty cool guys check this out say hi Dominic so we're just waiting for the ladies We're here at Moro Bay. We're just walking around. We're actually heading towards Giovanni's Fish Market. And we're gonna be eating and reviewing some of the food. And we're also gonna be making, uh, we're gonna be hanging out with our friends, Parkinson. You happy to be here? Yes, I'm very happy here. here. <laughs> Yes, they are. I forget that this is this right here is actually like a little dog area, so you can actually I think have your dog right there. You just have to clean up after yourself. See, Jessie's would be fun. So, Morro Bay is actually a place that Grace grew up going to. Babe, what would you guys do when you guys would come here to Morro Bay? What was like some of the fun things that you guys would do? Just hang out at the beach, just like enjoy time on the beach, you know, just have, sometimes we bring our own like burritos or sandwiches. We've eaten at Giovanni's. We'd spend most of the day here and just drive back home. So actually for me, I recently started coming in the last couple of years because of Grace, because of her family traditions. It became now our tradition to come at least once a year to have some of this Giovanni's fish market, very, very delicious, and to just spend some awesome family time. All right, Grace, what are we trying right now? Uh, we have the grilled halibut sandwich here. I'm gonna take a bite. Oh. Cheers. We already know we like a lot of this stuff, but this is actually a brand new item that we're trying out. All right, let me take a good bite. It tastes very fresh. Okay. This is really good. The bread, the fish is really juicy and tender. Um, the veggies that are with it, we're complimenting a lot. All right, guys, I'm gonna try the halibut, the grilled halibut sandwich here at Giovanni's Fish Market. Mm. <laughs> mm. Super delicious. Fish is uh, tender, flavorful. The veggies are incredible as well. Very, very fresh. The bread is super soft. I love it. Honestly, for me, this is a 4.5 out of 5 as well. It's so close to being perfect. It just needs a little more tartar sauce or something to like set it off. Overall, highly recommended if you're in the mood for a sandwich and not just fish and chips, which we usually get, but this is a good alternative. So what are these things? The scallops and chips. So let me open up and it comes with marinara sauce. So let me open it up. And then let me go ahead and dunk it. Alright, cheers everyone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We've had this one before. Out of five. Five out of five. So the sandwich out of five. I give it a four point five out of five. Four point five out of five. Mm -hmm. it's just bursting with flavor it's really juicy crispy on the outside has a little bit of a citrusy flavor from the seasoning so good cheers Cheer. <laughs> i'm gonna try the scallops now and like grace did i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna dip it in this cocktail sauce bam 
All right, these are really hot, so be careful when you're eating these because you can burn your mouth. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Did you burn yourself? Mm -hmm, I did. It was worth it though. Completely worth it. I would give these about a 4.5 out of 5 as well. Super sweet, nice and tender, cooked perfectly. The batter's delicious, the breading, everything works really well, salty with the sweet. Great combination offsetting. And then you have this, which gives it a little bit of a tang to just kind of give it that extra balance and that extra depth of flavor. So highly recommend dunking it into the cocktail sauce. <laughs> Cheers. All right. We have the cup of plum chowder. Also comes in a bread bowl, but since we have so much food, might as well. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah, the bread bowl is good, but, but we didn't want to like get too, too much. Though. I don't know if you can see it, but there's like paprika on it. Really elevates the flavors a little bit more. Really creamy. Definitely recommend it. It's a five out of five for me. I don't like it. Clam chowder. Right off the bat, you can see all the veggies, everything, potatoes, chowder. So here you go. Five out of five. This is the best clam chowder I've ever had in my life. You can taste the seasonings. It has like a nice, like almost like a garlicky taste, but I think it's more from the black pepper or white pepper. But you have some celery, some potato, delicious, very hearty. And this cup, I think even though it's a smaller cup, could be very, very filling. Cheers. Dude, that's dope. Is, are those pins or are those? No, it's the prawns. So cool. I want the concha. Get it. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I want a concha. I need to get that poison of that shirt, bro. You see this? It's right on this side. Right here. Right that's here. dope, dude. <laughs> Yeah. I love that movie, dude. It's been a minute since I've seen it, though. It's a soul. Ricky dies. Ricky. <laughs> Ricky. Ricky. Oh, wow. I like that. No, this is really awesome. So we just showed up here to Giovanni's Fish Market and they have this awesome outdoor swap meet here in their parking lot. We need that for mochi. We need that for mochi. Do you want one? Which one do you like? Let's do it. Do you want to just do the just the regular the, the, the regular the three? Yeah. <laughs> That was warm. That was warm. Yeah, they are 475. Wow, these are pretty big. All right, you want to try it out? Yeah. Let us know what you think. Get plenty of that powdered sugar. Never tried these before, but they look really good. Tastes like pancakes. Tastes like a pancake? <laughs> It has jam and powdered sugar on it. Oh, yeah, we're four out of four. Four out of five? Yeah, cool. oh, really buttery inside. <laughs> you want to try it? Yeah. All right, guys. There you go. Let's try it out. It tastes exactly like a pancake, just a little more spicier. Pretty good. Yeah, it does have spice on like cinnamon. Yeah, I like them. I would give them about 3.5 out of 5. It's not my favorite thing, but it's pretty good. It's sweet and it tastes pretty good mm -hmm. I would say overall mm -hmm. if you enjoyed our adventure to Morro Bay make sure you smash that like button and if you're new make sure you hit that subscribe button shout out to Park and Sip and we'll see you on the next one peace